guys and welcome back to our channel. This is Heather and today we are going to be showing you around World Showcase as we look for figments during the International Festival of the Arts. So we are doing the Festival of the Arts scavenger hunt and we've already found one in Mexico and Norway and they went ahead, we asked them and they gave us a little prize that goes with it. You can either get a Mickey Mini goofy or figment and I wanted figment I was afraid they'd sell out so I asked if we get a little early and we did. So I'm now hunting down all the paintings with figment in it. I love stuff like this like less well not last year several years ago we did it when Remy was here and I love tracking them down so now I'm I'm doing this too I love scavenger hunts. So we would highly recommend it because it is super fun so far. Yes. Our first stop was the Mexico Pavilion. This is one of our favorites. It's absolutely gorgeous inside. And here is our first figment. Okay guys, we are getting ready to go on the Mexico ride. This is one of our favorite rides to go on. It hardly ever has a really long wait. Uh, like we're here, it's almost 10 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> We are on our way to the Norway Pavilion. We ended up not getting to ride Frozen this day. It just consistently had an hour wait and we wanted to do other things. But this pavilion is also absolutely beautiful. I loved the artwork in the Norway Pavilion. It was a nod to the original Maelstrom ride. It was always one of our absolute favorites. We loved the trolls. This troll has been here since we were little girls and we love him. And next we're heading to China to get the next picture in the scavenger hunt. Okay, I think every pavilion is absolutely gorgeous. And it was a really beautiful day and I loved that I saw Mulan just walking around. She was looking in her reflection. It was just so pretty. And this is the next figment picture. We had to stop and get our picture with Mulan and she was a lot of fun to talk to. She told us that Mushu had made a painting for her with using his fire breath and you will see that right now. This is his picture and you'll see at the bottom he signed it. Next up is Germany. And this is the figment in the Germany Pavilion. This pavilion always smells so good with the candy, the pretzels, and then the restaurant. We always love to stop and watch the train for a little while before heading over to the next pavilion, which is Italy. This is the Italy Pavilion. It has a lot of great shopping and really good restaurants. And here is Figment. This is the American Pavilion. We ate at the Regal Eagle Smokehouse and it was delicious.
I loved all the decorations and they had signs on the walls as well that went with a the theme, but I saw one that said, a salute to all cookouts, but mostly barbecue, which I thought was hilarious. Gotta love that red, white, and blue. And then we ate at the American Pavilion's restaurant, the Regal Eagle Smokehouse, and we got the pulled pork barbecue. It was absolutely delicious. They had different sauces you could try. I thought it was great just by itself, but Sarah said the sauce was really good too. And we got one side with it and we got French fries. So it's some of the best barbecue I've had. It's really, really good. So if you like barbecue, definitely try that. And here's Figment crossing the Delaware. Next was Japan. Japan has one of the best stores. They have everything from pop culture to traditional outfits and chopsticks. They have such a good variety. And here is Figment. They also have this nice area that discusses the kawaii culture. And here's Morocco. I had a little bit of trouble finding the figment in this one, but I eventually found it, so it was a lot of fun. And here it is. I love all the beautiful detail in this pavilion. And this is the French Pavilion. I think this was the hardest figment for me to find. The fountain you'll see in just a moment holds a special memory for us. When we were little girls, we were here over Father's Day and there was a boat race. I can't remember if we won or not, but it was a lot of fun. Here's the figment. I'm sorry it's not the best video. Here we are making our way to the England Pavilion. One thing I love about this pavilion is that you'll usually see Alice, there she is, or Mary Poppins walking around. I thought it was kind of cool to see Mary Poppins' outfit in the window display, and there's her carousel horses. And if you look here, we found Peter Pan's shadow. Alice was heading back to Wonderland. Hi, 
Hi, Sarah. Sorry, this figment also had a bit of a glare, but he was still really cute. If you like this video, please consider giving it a like and subscribing. It would mean a lot. Last but not least, we headed to the Canadian Pavilion. And here is our final figment. The garden area in this pavilion is absolutely gorgeous and I love the waterfall. The scavenger hunt, also known as Figment's Brush with the Masters, was only $10. Thank you so much for joining us on our trip around World Showcase as we looked for Figment. We will see you next time.